Today on the What If Brigade, I am going to be doing a distance test of my decathlon e-bike. Yes, my uh, my 500 long tail decathlon e-bike, and I'm going to be testing it in eco mode to see how many kilometers I can travel. And uh, go ahead and put your guesses down in the comments below how far you think I'll get. But before you do, let me explain some of the caveats and conditions in terms of uh, my test today, the testing conditions, if you will. And uh, I am not going to be doing a hypothetical max distance test because that would require a flat level surface like salt flats. It would require a much lighter rider than me. It would require a much more physically fit rider than me. And it would require taking off all of the extraneous accessories and having a support vehicle that carries the bike tools and the water and the food. And that isn't really the, uh, the riding conditions that I usually face when I'm going on a long bike ride. My bike is more than a year old now. It has 3,000 kilometers on it. Uh, <clears throat> I am big and heavy. Uh, and when I go on a long bike ride, I not only bring my regular bike tools, uh, I bring extra water and snacks uh, because I'm going a long ways and I'm probably going to get hungry. And possibly more importantly than that, when the battery hits 62.5%, I'm going to turn around. And this isn't just because I believe the manufacturers when they say that going below 25% of battery life into the reserve is bad for the battery. It's also because when I go on a long bike ride, I think it's a great idea to leave yourself a little bit of a reserve. So if that is, there is a detour or you desperately need some water or something, you have the ability to go a few extra kilometers. So that's the outline of how I'm doing the test today. Uh, and uh, so I just wanted to let you know in terms of how I'm doing that. And I think this is a great way to do a test. This is very similar to the way I tested the normal mode. I got 33 kilometers doing that. And I feel confident telling people that the bike can go 33 kilometers because I feel it can do it under real world conditions and they're not going to get stranded somewhere. They're going to have a little bit of a reserve. They're going to have a little bit of a cushion. So that's my philosophy. Uh, there'll be a few more videos on, on this uh, as and once I complete uh, my uh, eco mode uh, distance uh, um, challenge for this bike. So uh, have a great day and let me know your guesses for how many kilometers I'm going to get down in the comments below.